welcome this is the energy vibration laden for the um, Gemini Sun Moon and Rising it is the fourth week of January 2017 uh, 2018 why am I still in 2017 I want to say thank you to all your Ge the Gemini's thank you for your likes and shares please support this channel by thumbs up likes and shares so, this week is the week of a fire energy your water so um, you have to be careful in this week what is happening there's a lot of transformation that is happening in this week it's like a real masculine week um, so you have to be aware of uh, certain situations that are happening okay um, the zodiac energy is going to be here so that's a wonderful energy so um, it's balancing out um, situations for you okay so this is going to be good the energy of um, the week is the number 15 energy which is a fire energy there's a lot of stuff that is going on here because um you have a lot of ha things that are happening in this week and this is going to be a very positive week so let's look at the first day on Monday we have the eight of cups okay the eight of cups is always that some people are leaving certain things behind some people are moving forward and transforming in a way that is you know wonderful in the sense that you've realized that certain things certain things need to be um, remove out of your life so you're leaving you're turning you're really turning your back on certain things and moving forward to something that is much better on Tuesday you have another water energy um, and earth energy my excuses which is the energy of balance so this energy of balance is the energy of you trying to find balance with um, deciding to make that decision and move away from something that no longer serves you and you are having the space and time to understand what is happening so you can make that right decision to move away from something that is not really working for you which is going to bring you to a place of positive energy as we look at the energy on uh, Wednesday and the crowning of your week you have the nine of swords so it is always about you guys your thoughts and everything and what you're going to do in this week is try and calm it down and bring more po positive uplifting thoughts than scattered thoughts okay because there's a sort of a scattered thoughts that are coming up and you need to just bring it in balance so on Thursday which is wonderful you have this fire energy in the reverse which is a positive energy especially um, because it's a week of hair and the energy of fire and hair doesn't real really work that well because you're in a fire week already and you have this energy of the week and it's in the reverse form because the energy of the week is this but this is in the reverse form so whatever that has been working whatever that has been transpiring you're seeing here what is going on on Friday you're going to have a situation where you're thinking was this the good idea or you know um, should I have gone this route and this sort of a thing and I am saying to you yes um, sometimes honesty is the best policy and whatever that may transpire and that sort of a thing you have done the thing that you know that is right so there is going to be a lot of situations that people are thinking of uh, you know I am leaving the situation behind I'm gonna have balance and understand that whatever is transpiring and whatever is happening okay in the weekend you have and this has been happening for a lot of you here sign you have an earth energy this in the weekend some of you will be having the energy of the Knights of Pentacles and the energy vibration 
of the night of Pentacles it is someone between the ages of uh, um, 25 and 45 and this is um, a situation where um, if you don't have to deal with someone between that age group then it's going to be a situation where you're balancing out certain your financial situation for some people who are just starting out money is going to be coming but it's going to be coming slowly into you okay on Sunday a very wonderful energies uh, finally because now you're connecting with your family you're feeling good about yourself you're feeling yes it's going to be a very emotional week um, because um, there is a lot of transition that is happening but on Sunday you are going to have a positive energy that is working out with your family your overall energy for the week is a five of cups so a lot of you are going to have some regrets that is happening in this week and we are going to be looking at what is going to be happening okay so let's see um, what is going to transpire in this week if there needs to be messages then we will um, find these messages okay what I'm seeing happening here is that we have the energy of the six of cups in reverse so a lot of you people are moving away or if it's not you it's someone who you have known from a past lifetime is moving away turning their backs on you um, and you need to have balance and understanding because you have the energy of the four of cups so there is going to be a regret so in the first um, you know part of the week you're going to really feel and see that someone is uh, you know you know moving away from you um, um, turning their backs on you and it's gonna be okay because that means they need to leave your life for whatever reason it was they really need to leave your life so it's gonna be okay and you know um, whatever that transpire and whenever people are turning their backs because these are like people um, some can be family member is as if they're um, against you and that sort of a thing so let's see who is turning their backs on you the king of one so this is good um, so let's say for the people who were having relationships um, with the knight of wands which is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius this is someone over the ages of 40 this person is turning you know turning their backs at you and moving forward it is a past life situation it's someone who you have known in lifetimes and lifetimes before you are not feeling any regrets about this because this needs to happen okay this is something that has happened in your life and you're moving away and moving forward out of your life okay so as we move forward we're looking at what is happening in the middle of the week in the middle of the week we have a situation that balance is coming in with this balance you have to deal with the energy of the nine of swords that is an energy of a lot of stuff going on in your head because of the strengths this transition that is happening in your life and this person is a fire sign it is a fire week um, it is the energy of an Aries and Leo or Sagittarius man and this is someone over the ages of 40 whatever the transition is whatever that is it can a man but it can also woman whatever that transition is this person needs to leave your life they need to remove away from your life so you can move forward okay what is happening is that um, they have been a, a sort of a set a sort of a spark of a break in you so you're moving forward and you're looking forward because we're looking at the middle of the week and what is happening here is that the energy of the hurt is as if the energy or you know it's saying come balance yourself this is going to be good just balance out whatever is happening 
you know stop the mind from chattering and balance out whatever is happening and what is gonna happen is that you as some of you are coming because a lot of people are leaving stuff behind and it's the month of January because what is happening now is that some of you are turning your back on someone who is um, t between the ages of 25 and 45 and is an a Taurus a Virgo or a Capricorn some of you women are turning your back on this person so um, you um, women you Gemini's are really really turning your back on someone who is the knight of coins this person is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorns and you are really standing up turning your back and saying you know bye because this has a family connection as or it has a karmatic connection because we have um, our soul family um, or karmatic situations that we need to do but you're turning your back on this person and this is the energy of the knight of coins so it could be a family member that something has transpired and you're thinking I'm letting this go and I'm moving forward and I'm you know turning my back on this as we look at the last day of the week there is the energy of the ten of ones the energy of the ten of ones whatever this ten of ones was it has to do with uh, the thoughts and the energy that you know of the fire energy that is going on but that is in reverse and then at the end of the day even though you feel as if things are very burden burdensome now there is going to be a very happy family life together there is going to be a very very happy family life so this is um, a positive situation that is coming out okay there is going to be a very very positive shit situation that is happening for you there is a new start there is a new journey for some of um, for some of you um, you're going to decide you know that you know it is best for me to move on away from this relationship the situation and it has to deal with someone who is between the ages of 25 and 45 and is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn because you're you you you're really noticing now that it's not a complete match this is not a good connection this is you know no matter what I do it won't be as how I wish it will but you know it's it's, it's very good because what I'm seeing here is actually leaving stuff behind is as, as if you're making your new year's resolution and you're really you know just leaving stuff behind which is very positive okay um that's five on one six so um, your numbers is going to be six and ten six and ten so this is good okay so let's see what is happening for you guys in this week oh my gosh we I just shuffled it I got the same thing again so soul child so I, I, I guess a lot of people soul child came up and I just um, use it again now we have number seven unplug from the mass consciousness so this is a wonderful experience this is um, the universe saying to you unplug yourself it's like removing yourself from the matrix it's like really really moving yourself out of the matrix understanding what is transpiring in your world and moving yourself from out of the matrix which is um, going to be very wonderful and very exciting so it's saying unplug yourself from out the masses of consciousness and I really do that I remember there was um, a group that I was working with and they started connecting me without asking me and I just removed myself out of the consciousness of the group and um, you know it was the best thing that I've ever done so ladies and gentlemen let's look 
if you have any questions for this week ask your question because I'm using the angels of answer ask your question and the answer is don't stop the answer is don't stop so let's say you guys were frustrated because you have been trying to get a job and you've been going out there and you're trying and you and it's not happening and that it says don't stop don't stop just try go on don't stop so I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back um it is a wonderful wonderful year for you guys it's going to be a very positive year for the people who are having birthdays in this year and I want to say to each and every person no matter what is happening outside try and make sure that you're balanced with the inside namaste until next week